Donald Trump's mother was his complete opposite. Trump's mother was an immigrant. She was born shortly after the Titanic sank. She came to America with only $70. She inspired her son's famous hairdo. Trump rarely described her as anything more than a housewife. She once reportedly asked Trump's first wife, What sort of son have I created? Marianne McLeod was born in Scotland in 1912. This was just after the Titanic disaster. She grew up on the remote Isle of Lewis. Her home was a fishing village called Tong. She was the youngest of 10 children. The area was very poor and dirty. Her family scraped by through fishing. Mary spoke Gaelic and learned English in school. At 17, she boarded a ship to New York City. Mary had her reasons to sail to America if she stayed. Job options were limited, weaving Harris tweed or curing herring. World War I left few eligible local men. 17% of soldiers from the island perished. In 1919, 200 more drowned offshore when their ship sank. The religious island shamed Mary's sister for an illegitimate child. Catherine sailed for New York first. Mary arrived in the city with $70 to her name. At first, she found work as a maid in Manhattan. She worked for Andrew Carnegie's widow. Soon Mary met Fred Trump, an up-and-coming developer. They met at a dance in the city. They married in January 1936. Mary gave Fred five children, including Donald J. Trump. Mary mostly worked as a housewife, but she sometimes helped with her husband's business. For example, she collected coins from laundry machines in their apartment buildings. She raised her children as Presbyterians. Mary had a major health scare after her son Robert's birth. She hemorrhaged, needing an emergency hysterectomy. In the 1990s, she was mugged. Mary sustained brain, sight, and hearing damage. Her husband constantly cheated on her. Fred had a long-term affair with his secretary. He took her to the same lunch spot for years. In Miami, he was known as King for his philandering. Yet Donald thought his parents were doing great. His classmate recalled a chat they had. Trump praised his dad for shaping him as a killer, but he didn't mention his mom. He later wrote a book calling her a traditional housewife, but that wasn't the whole truth. Mary kept ties to her Scottish roots. She supported charities and visited her home country. Donald went with her once as a boy. In 2008, he returned to Scotland. He spent a mere 97 seconds in his mother's home. In the 2000s, Trump started building a Scottish golf course. He clashed with politicians and locals. In 2016, his racist rhetoric inflamed tensions. Trump proposed banning immigrants from Muslim-majority nations. Scottish leaders were outraged by such talk. Nicola Sturgeon stripped Trump of global Scott status. Mary passed before seeing Donald elected president, but she witnessed his celebrity ascent. Amid public drama with Marla Maples, Mary asked her daughter-in-law, Ivana, What kind of son have I created? Mary died in 2000, aged 88, a year after her husband. She left the world, just as Donald entered a new realm of fame.